Hi friends, good morning. Let us see our next problem. See a boat running upstream takes 8 hours 48 minutes to cover a certain distance. While it takes 4 hours to cover the same distance running up, downstream. See, upstream time. Upstream time is equal to 8 hours 48 minutes. That is equal to 8, 48 by 16, 12 fours, 12 fives, 8 fives, 44 by 44 by 5 hours. So, upstream time, upstream time, 44 by 5 hours and downstream time, downstream time, 4 hours. See, now the ratio of the times, ratio of the times, upstream is to downstream time is equal to 44 by 5 is to 4 4 ones 4 elevens that is equal to 11 is to 5 or 11 by 5 upstream time is to downstream time times ratio 11 is to 5 times ratio 11 is to 5 if you reverse this ratio if you reverse this ratio you will get the ratio of their speeds. So, up speed, upstream speed, us is to ds is equal to 5 is to 11. Upstream, see times ratio 11 is to 5. Times ratio 11 is to 5. If you reverse the times ratio, you will get the speeds ratio. See, you know us, now you know ds. See, you want, you need to find the ratio between the speed of the boat in still water and current rate of current so you need to find x is to y you need to find x is to y so when ds and us are known when ds and us are known x is equal to ds plus us by 2 x is equal to speed of the boat in still water y is equal to ds minus us by 2 this is the rate of the current. This is the rate of the current. Now you have to find x is to y. You have to find x is to y. x is equal to ds plus us by 2. 11 plus 5 by 2, 16 by 2, that is equal to 8. Second one, y, ds minus us by 2. 11 minus 5, 6, 6 by 2, 3. So your answer is 8 by 3 or 8 is to 3. Okay friends, thank you. Have a nice day.